Well, hello there. Welcome to a Wednesday stream. Here down in the Juggalo dungeon, you're here with me, Shovel of Precious Juggalos. Uh, I need a haircut. I'm realizing that right now. So that's that's happening. Uh, anyway, uh, it's Wednesday. Um, yep, Precious Juggalos, live painting and chill. Here with me, Shovel. Uh, first things first, of course... Just like always, we've got to decide what beverage are we going to drink today to keep us going. And, uh, well, it should be no surprise because I've whoa, been drinking whoa. a lot of this lately. Oh, there's a surprise. Somebody forgot to turn his camera on. It's running behind today. Oh, there it is. Stop it from shaking. What's up, JR? So we'll be doing another two cans of Fago Cotton Candy. Because I have, I don't know, another 16 cans in my uh, fridge right now. Somebody did not do a great job of washing my cup. It's been another interesting day that I'm happy to be wrapping up down here in the dungeon. Mm, try to get some uh, painting therapy going. I did have one exciting thing happen today. I did my first international order. It's taken a long time to get that all sorted out, but uh, if you're from Canada right now, I am now shipping to Canada. It should populate a Canada shipping surcharge in my shop. When uh, when you put in your address, click Fago Break. So there's that. Uh, I've also had quite a few. Well, quite a few. I've had a few. Uh, fans from the UK that have reached out in one way or another asking about getting um, shipping expanded to the United Kingdom. Set that up as well. So uh, if you're from Canada, it's a $20 flat fee to ship anything to you. If you're from the UK, it's a $25 flat fee to ship to you. So uh, cheers, everybody. There you go. Precious Juggalos has taken over the world. Now I got my uh, my US map over here. And then I start shipping outside of the U.S. So I, I don't know what I'm going to do there. Um, maybe I'll just uh, add Canada on top there. And then just UK somewhere to the side. I really don't know that I'll be shipping too many other places in the world. Because uh, it just gets crazy to try to keep up with all that stuff. With all the different rules and regulations. And uh, Canada and the U.K. We kind of have pretty good you know, systems in place for that. I think I can handle those. <sighs> anyway, enough of that. Enough yakking, enough Fago breaks. Oh, let's, uh, let's relax. Let's focus. Let's uh, get to work. Because uh, I need to finish up this piece that we've been working on now for a couple of days. Uh, the latest Show Me Your Butthole. Uh, I was hoping to get it finished yesterday. Um, it's very, very close. Very, very close. But, uh, you know, I just had... I had a thing I had to do right after stream yesterday, so I couldn't couldn't work after. And then uh, I'm trying to finish up watching um, the... JR. Oh, I think... I think I've had a stroke. Um, Fallout. Fallout. Yeah, I've got one episode left of Fallout. The thing that's delaying me is I'm watching it with my oldest daughter, and, you know, she's got an earlier bedtime than me, so, uh, I'm, I'm being nice, and I'm watching it with her. Uh, so we've got one more episode to go. I'm really hoping we can squeeze it in tonight. I've got someplace else I have to be this evening. Not that any of this matters to anyone else. I'm just uh, explaining myself to myself, I guess. Um, but yeah, regardless, we're going to finish this up today. 
I say that now, I realize I need the hot glue gun. And it's not down here. Um, let me see if I can't call in a favor from my wife. And then if she says, oh, you're driving. Okay. Well, then I'm talking to myself right now completely. Because <laughs> it's just you and me, JR. And uh, that that's kind of a shame because I was going to ask you about the uh, the thing you post about on, uh, posted about on Discord. Because um, I, I don't... I don't know anything about it. Uh, I'm very curious, but uh, but you drive. We can we can talk about it some other time. Oh, now you're not driving. Okay, well, <laughs> dang it, make a decision, Jr. <laughs> so, okay, okay. Um, was yeah, dude. I swear. I swear. It, it's been a weird day. Setting up uh, international shipping on a square site, just FYI, sucks. It's it's real hard. It's not easy. That's what she said. That's easy. I need a I need a that's easy button. That'd be cool. Anyway, uh focus up, man. Just rambling and Hey, Virginia. I that I need the yeah, I need the hot glue gun. There we go. Thank you. All right. Now, now we're good to go. So the weird thing about this is we're going to be turning hot glue into hot goo. Um, that's the goal, anyway. We want this to end up looking like the uh, honey stuff that they use when they're doing uh, body waxing and whatnot. Um, first, I need to paint this crayon to look like a uh, piece of wood. So there's that. Um, leather brown, I think, will be good. And then we're going to do some... Try to do some weird dry brushing. This is so small. I, I hope it translates. I don't know if it's going to work. But we're going to try. We're doing a whole lot of firsts on this, this piece. And so far, so good. So here we go. Really don't need much of these colors. <gasps> Alright. Whoop whoop, y'all. I haven't said that in a minute, it feels like. Forgetting my own catchphrase. That is a lot browner than I was expecting. I thought it was going to be a little more pale. Hmm. Let's see if I can shoot the gap right there. That's kind of a tight space. Oh. Dang it, that's on her finger. Yeah, so is that is that like a uh an online thing or what a uh, is it Is it like uh regarding live music or um what it what is it? <laughs> okay. So, and it is it sp specifically like reviewing music videos or uh, audio files, or is it like uh, 
ridiculousness stuff. Oh, 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 oh. So it's like wild and out, sort of. Except not face to face and not exactly like directly in opposition of each other. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Okay, okay. I dig that. Yeah, I could get down with that. In fact, I think there needs to be more of that in this world. When I ran a music venue, I used to have a uh, annual Battle of the Bands called Rocktober, and uh, throughout the month, different bands, different genres would play. Hey, Maya, and uh, and it would be true battle format. Each night would have a winner, and then that winner would be coming for each night. Let me start over. <laughs> so every Friday and Saturday for the entire month of October leading up to Halloween, which would be a big show, um, it would be Battle of the Bands format. The It'd be like three or four bands. Whoever was the top band of the night would move on. Um, and then I think, if I remember right, the last weekend we, we would have like a final showdown to get the top three. And then those top three would open for whatever big touring act I would bring in for Halloween, which sometimes, well, all, all times they were big shows, but, um, some were like real legit for like in the hardcore scene anyway. Um, and that was, that was cool. The only problem was sometimes, you know, it would be like a, Hardcore or metal Halloween show, but like a, uh, um, like an alt country or alt rock band would, uh, would be one of the top three. So the genres wouldn't exactly line up, but everybody was just so stoked to be there that, uh, and I don't know, it, it just became more about the music anyway. Everybody just kind of appreciated that they were playing with the best at that time. It was fun. I miss it. Anyway, memories. Oh yeah. So remember I've been missing a couple of paintbrushes this for this whole week. I found them. They're up by the kitchen sink. But uh I forgot to bring them down with me. So I still don't have them. So I'm still kind of mm. But I've been kind of mm, all week. All right, let's lighten this thing up a little bit. It's a little too dark. You know what? I think I need to get something, a happy medium between these two colors. That's what we're talking about. Okay, that's that's more more like popsicle stick color. Let me get my psycho brush out here. Put it in nice and tight. Oh, dang. You know, nobody will ever really see this angle that I'm painting right here. But I know it's here, so I can't just let it go. Alright, that looks that looks like a, 
like a tongue depressor. Let me, um, I mean, the shape is a little weird because it's cylindrical. Perfect camera. Perfect. Perfect. Don't worry about focusing on that. The only thing. There it is. Yeah. Kind of tongue depressor, depressor, the de popsicle stick. <laughs> yeah. And it's kind of got a uh, inconsistent wood grainy kind of look to it. So I think we're good. I think we're good. So let me plug in the hot glue gun. Get that hot gluing. Words are hard. Yes. Oh, are you? No, I'm not ignoring chat. Are you behind? I'm up to date. I'm talking right to you guys. Uh, Caroline's not here, so I'm I'm completely engaged. Oh, I need to message Caroline though and let her know. <laughs> you have paid. You have paid. You've bought a piece. Shut up. <laughs> oh gosh, don't mind me. Ah. You know what? Maybe I will just put a QR code up there. Hey, you got questions? Hit that QR code, pay me five bucks, and I'll, uh... That's what Super Chats are for. <laughs> if I ever get this, uh, channel, you know, up and up, let me, let me actually message Caroline really quick and just let her know. Um... Oh, crud. Oh, too many things going on at the same time. But up, 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 up. Okay. Doing final touches. Okay. That's sent to Caroline. Hot glue gun is hot. Hot gluing. Heating up. Um, what I need is a surface to work on. Um, so I'm gonna want to mix the paint and the hot, the hot glue. Excuse me. Um, at the same time, ooh, how about a stir stick for the paint that I used to paint the back wall? It it does get hot. It's very true. Which I need it to. I need it to be hot. Um, yeah. <sighs> well, you know what? While it's heating up, how's about a quick Fago break? Mmm. Ah, so good. So good. Break's over. Oh, turn it, turn it on, turn it on. Yep, turn it on. Should have, should have done that. So, how's everybody doing? <laughs> Actually, while we're waiting, I should probably pick out a good honey color. Um... Actually, might not be too bad. It's kind of hard to predict is what it's going to look like once it's, uh, like, combined with the glue. So I would assume it would thin it out and make it lighter? I would, I would think? I don't know. Also, I, I think wax, the stuff, is kind of a, a darker shade, I think. At least in the movies. That's my experience with body waxing as a 40-year-old virgin. So, let me clean my brushes. Okay. 
clean that brush and pick my nose. I know, yeah, that scene was crazy. Yeah, that was back when Steve Carell was still trying to make a name for himself, so he was doing the most insane things he could think of. He don't gotta do that no more. Okay, anyway. Well, yep, it is getting hot now. Good news, everyone. So let's let's do a little test drive of the uh, paint and glue mixing. Oh, not not hot enough. False alarm. Yeah, it feels hot enough. Oh, now it's going. Oh, okay. Okay. Abject failure. Immediate abject failure. Okay, so don't do it like that. What have we learned? Um... Hmm... <laughs> yeah... I, I know what you're talking about, JR. Okay. How... How do we make this work? I don't want Let's see if we can Oh no, it's stuck to my brush. Dude. No, not not cool. Not cool. Crud. 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 Now it's stuck to the brush and the gun. Okay, what have we learned today, kids? That, that was close, though. That method almost worked. That came very close. But now my tip is full of glue. No bueno. No bueno. Um, hmm. Well, this is now my hot glue brush. This is officially my hot glue brush. Um, we did get some on the uh, the stick. Um, let me see. Let's see if I can't ruin this brush a little further. I do. I like the color that we're getting out of it. Okay, that might be a thing. That that might that might have done it. Oh. Okay, well that definitely did it. Yeah. Look at that. Let me zoom in a little bit. Uh Focus in. Look at that. That looks, that looks like gloopy wax. You spent all that time painting the stick and now you can't really see the stick. 
because it's covered in gloopy wax. Yeah, that... <laughs> Yet again, uh, doing something I've never done before. Completely worried about it, completely freaked out, and then uh, you just head down, power through, and... Ba-bam! You've, uh, you've created honey wax out of hot glue and brown paint. Of course, I ruined a brush in the meantime. Uh, but that's cool. I never liked this brush anyway. We had a lot of arguments. Actually, it's not true. I do like this brush. All right, I'm going to put that brush back on the wall because I won't be painting with that anymore. That is our hot glue brush for the rest of eternity. Um, and now I can unplug the hot glue gun. Let me turn it off. Let me make sure I didn't leave a bunch of glue, or I mean uh, paint, on the tip. Which I did. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hot. It's hot. In fact, let me just run a little bit of glue out of here and make sure it's clear. Yep, it is. Good deal. All right. All right, Bartons. How about that? How about that? Stinking awesome. I was really worried about that whole situation. Now it's in the rear view mirror, and we can just focus on... Uh, Doing some finish paint, some finishing touches, and done. Um, well, your name is... A, I, I said Bartons. Your name's in your name. Silly. Bagel break. Cheers. Well, I never... I never said it was specifically you. Could be another Barton. I don't know. Maybe Maya's got somebody with her. People don't necessarily know that the two of you are together. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, yeah. <laughs> what are you saying, JR? <laughs> and you know, it's funny that, like, <clears throat> excuse me, this, uh, this stream isn't, like, bigger, because we're at the tail end of this. This is what this is the money shot right here. This is the uh, the big kablamo, and nobody's here to see it. Whatever. I don't know what more I can do for you people. Gosh. <laughs> kablamo. All right, let me get my magnifier going, my psycho brush going, my black paint going. We're going to tidy up the face paint on this little lady. One brow was kind of bothering me.
uh, the dual stream. Oh, yeah. Um, so, have I looked into it? Yes. Have I done anything beyond looking into it? No. <laughs> Uh, I need to, man. I'm at such a weird point in all of this where I, I feel like I I need to be spending more time painting, but then I also want to be, like, enriching this experience. It should... I... I'm on a... Well, I'm on, I'm on a Mac that, uh doesn't do anything else but this stream, it very much should be able to handle it. Yeah. Yeah, I need to... I need to make it happen. Definitely need to make it happen. Because it, it's definitely seems to be a real chore getting people to uh, migrate over from I'm at almost 3200 followers on Facebook now but I'm still under 500 over here Yeah, there are definite goals here. <laughs> it would be cool to have a... Uh, like, I, I've, I've watched Wiggle's streams lately. He's been having other people join in his streams. And then he has them basically watch the chat for him and, like, read the chat while he's got his face down like I do right now. Um, so it it would be cool to have a situation like that. Um, but that's also weird, you know? I don't know. Oh, wow. I just noticed one side goes a lot lower than the other. Ah. <laughs> okay. I think... I think I'm good on the black side of things. I think it's time to do a final pass on white. And then there's a little bit of color work on the, um, the canvas that I want to do. But then I think we're done, done, done. Whoa, something just flashed up on my screen. Or was it me? It was me, because I... Yeah, it was me. Never mind. Never mind. Losing my mind. Alright, get my eyes back on here.
So the piece that sold to uh, Canada, by the way, was the uh, that first Garbage Pail Kid piece that I did, Leaky Lindsay. I've had it this whole time. I've just had it uh, where you couldn't see it in the shop because uh, the person in Canada wanted it. And I wanted to figure out how to ship to Canada. Dang it. I was holding it for her while I figured all that out, and then she she helped me test it to make sure it was working, so it's nice to have her be willing to be patient with me. And it really, it is weird how, uh, how many tumbleweeds are kind of coming through the, the stream today. I've been on for uh, almost 40 minutes. There's something something bigger going on right now. Watch where at war with Iran or something. specific little tool here. Yeah. Yeah, I think I would rather be here than uh, watching the coverage of uh, World War III. Okay. Oh, nope, 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 nope. One more, one more spot here. Little dab of black.
Oh. Hey, Wiggles. Uh, I'm assuming on Discord. Ten four JR. Okay. I believe the face is done, done. So let me get back to the canvas here. There's just uh, a couple of spots where the yellow has no red behind it. And I I don't like that. I don't like the way it looks. So these will be very, very small minor adjustments. Hopefully very quick adjustments. There's a spot for the light. Oh, show me your butthole? <clears throat> Excuse me. Is it a band called Honey Bunches of Death? Because uh, they contacted me. Um, they talked about uh, commissioning a piece, but they were needing it for an album album release party. And the first single, the title is Show Me Your Butthole, but it was in like two weeks and it just wasn't going to work out. So, so no, um, but the, uh, the guy that contacted me, he's going to try to actually source and paint his own. He asked if I was okay with that. 
was like, uh, yeah. <laughs> Obviously, he was going to give me credit for the idea and all that. Um, so yeah, I'm cool with it. I wish we would have had more time. It would have been nice to uh, have a signature piece on their merch table. Um, I can't remember why I got this red out. Oh, I already, already did it. Never mind. Okay, I think one more little chunk of red here, and I think I'll be done with it. Okay, done with red. Yes, yes. Couple touches of white, and then I think... I think I'm done, done, done. Oh, don't do that. Actually, I might do a little, some yellow touches, too. It's a couple of spots where the yellow is not as uh, bold. So it looks inconsistent. was totally clean.
Hmm. I don't think it's getting better. Okay, I know I said I was done with the white, but I'm not. I lied. There's a little part next to the R that I don't like. And there's still just a little, little nubbins under one of the T's that I'm not digging. That's that. There's a little bit of white in her eye that I want to clean out. But then I would say that this piece is completely done. There it is. I believe that is a completed show me your butthole figurine. With custom uh, wax on her stick, custom logo on the apron, and then the classic Violent J face paint show me your butthole signage. Actually on camera now. Real fast, real fast. While we're here. If I don't do it, I'll be haunted by it for the rest of my life. Plus, we've got we've got time. We've got time. Should be a very quick touch. Okay. Now, the completed piece. Bum ba da dum ba da dum bum bum. What I'm talking woo, about. Woo! Woo! Okay, so that's done. So uh, tomorrow I'll. Start on a new piece, or... Actually, you know what? Tomorrow... I might start on this, this other Abe Lincoln I've got. Just to get him off the desk. He's heavy, though. He won't be fun to ship. But... This is another commission completed, and I feel good about it. 
Now all I need to do is uh, hit it with some clear coat, send some final pictures to uh, the client, get her final approval, receive final payment, and then ship her out. So there you go. That's uh, three days worth of work there. <laughs> Which sounds stupid when I say it out loud, that it took me three days just to do this. But it did, because we like to do it right. Um, so anyway, thanks to JR and Maya and uh, Wiggles for joining me today. And uh, pretty much every other day. Um, thanks to the one creep that we've had today, too. I've, I saw you. Um, Thanks for sticking around. I stream every Monday through Friday here on YouTube, 4.30 p.m. to 5.30 p.m. Uh, Central Standard Time. Uh, yeah, I'm also on, I'm here on YouTube, I'm on Facebook, I'm on Instagram, I'm on TikTok, I always forget that. Um, also over on Reddit, on in all the places, I am Precious Juggalos. Just look for that, query that, and you will find me. Um, JR just dropped a link to my shop in the chat. If you are uh, in the United States, the lower 48 states, not all of them, uh, or Canada, or the UK, um, check out that site if there's anything that you like. Feel free to purchase it, um, and I will get it sent your way. I am struggling to keep up. Uh, there isn't much left in the site, but we'll make it happen, Captain. I'm, uh, I'm trying to get some stuff painted. Uh, the other link that JR just dropped in the chat, if you are a Juggalo or into Juggalo things or curious about Juggalos, click on that Discord link. It'll take you to a Discord server that uh, is occupied primarily by Juggalos, discussing Juggalo things, um, kind of like the chat today, um, talking about uh, live shows and bands and all the other things. Um, if you're curious about any of those things, sign up for that Discord server. Uh, these guys keep their fingers on the pulse of Juggalo whatnots and happenings, and they can definitely keep you abreast of the situation, JR especially, He's, uh, he's the man. He just knows things. Um, and that's what I appreciate about him. That and he also is just a constant supporter. And that's awesome. Even when he's driving. Um, and in a lot of things. hey -o! Before we go, let's hit a Jesus. Yeah. Alright, so, uh... <laughs> So thanks, uh, thanks for showing up. Thanks for watching this happen. Um, see y'all tomorrow. And uh, wise words of the day, nothing really. Um, just uh, when you're not con like confident about something, just give it a shot. Maybe shoot your shot. Maybe it'll, maybe it'll go in. Maybe it won't. If it doesn't, then you know, practice or Google it. I don't know. Whoop whoop, Jr. I'll talk to you later, man. Thanks again for being here. Bye.